But before we get too far into today's video, I want to let you guys know that Caesar's Ark is going to be wiping Saturday, which is tomorrow as of the upload of this video. If you're watching this after the day that it was uploaded, then it's already wiped on February the 12th. It's a 10 man with six man maps as well, which is kind of weird, but it works really well. Allows smaller groups to compete um, with uh, 10x rates and it's a lot of fun. Um, sometimes I record on there. Uh, I'm going to be putting out another video that's going to showcase all the stuff that happened in the previous season. I'm going to be doing season recaps at the end of every season. And we do have a cash prize for the Alpha Tribe. Um, so if you guys are interested, I put a link down in the description as well as the pinned comment. Anyways, let's get into the video, boys. Okay, boys. So we are back. It's been a little bit, but we're going to go ahead and spawn back in. Um, I need to find somewhere to store some of the shit that I have on me, to be entirely honest. Because I want to try and see if I can get this base location that I was looking at yesterday. So I might just, I'll probably just store stuff in the transmitter that's up here. There's not a huge amount of people on right now, so it's pretty unlikely that of the people that will be here that they'll go straight to that transmitter. And then I need to grab one of my stalkers, the lower level one of the two, and check to see if that spot's empty. Because if it is, then I'll come back, get the rest of my stuff. We'll slap some foundations and some uh, like boxes and stuff down th up there. Because we need to stop living out of the obelisk. We're not going to make any progress without a small base slap down somewhere. So let's throw everything in there for now, hope for the best, and let's go check this spot out, see if anybody's in there. Anybody in there? Uh, well, there's a rock drake here, so that's not a great sign. And there's a zipline anchor. Also not the best sign in the world. And some turrets. But you know what, actually, those turrets look really close. I might be able to, I might be able to do something here, to be honest. Maybe if I just farm up some rockets, I might be able to splash that wall. Oh yeah, 100%, that's an easy drop. I need to do a poly run. I'm trying to think of the best way to do that right now. I'm thinking I'll probably have to tame a dino for it though. So I'll probably get myself a bear really fast. Where would be the best place to get a bear on this map? Oh, literally right here. Okay, so I'm gonna grab the stuff that I had in the transmitter we'll go ahead and start getting on taming a bear we'll get some poly we need to slap down a little something something somewhere so i think i'll grab the rest of the stuff out of my ob and we'll head up to a high shelf somewhere near that base and slap everything down because that looks like a really easy raid if, if i'm not mistaken i think i can actually just shoot rockets and just splash all that shit down to be honest go ahead and pick up the floor even and we'll put everything in there. All right, so we got our little vault down. I need to go back to the uh, transmitter though, because I guess I'm at some point must have uploaded my pick and I'll need to make some arrows so that I can knock this bear out. Oh, okay, let's grab that, that, soups, because why not? Wait, I didn't upload my pick, so where did my pick go? All right, we get the bear in the trap and we close the trap up behind it. Boom, done. There we go and boom. That's why I'm going for the spot that I'm going for and that's why I'm picking everything up is I don't want to leave any sign that I actually exist. All right, there we go. Got ourselves a bear, not too shabby. Go ahead and cryo this thing up. All right, so we're not gonna be down here for too long. I think that's probably enough polymer for now. We only really need enough to get going. I don't wanna like over farm or anything because the plan is to try and raid that spot. And to do that, we need to get like stuff done as soon as possible. So these guys, if they are offline or off map or whatever, don't come back. Um, But yeah, that should be enough, I think. Bro, where, my rock Drake egg's gone. Are you serious? What's going on, man? Everything still has 19 hours left on it, so I know it didn't despawn. Oh, that is foul, man. Oh, man, I'm I'm actually pretty pressed. Oh, it's not here, dude. <sighs> All right, whatever, I mean. 
It is what it is. We'll just start from nothing. Ooh, that was lucky. I just found a blue drop that has structures in it. So we will take all of those. That saves us a little bit of time. Um, I do need some electronics though. So I've decided I'm gonna head on over to Genesis and take my Giga. And that way we can go ahead and get ourselves a good bit of electronics. Oh, we'll get oil from this as well. Easy farm. Okay, never mind. Oh, I should have got a kangaroo and then I could have brought it over here and got all sorts of mats. We'll do that once we have a full base up there. All right, so Captain's Quest is the closest mission terminal. It's not very far. And I don't need a crazy amount of stuff right now, so this is actually probably fine for what all we needed. We'll grab that as well. Grab that, drop that. Go ahead and cryo this bad boy up. I also don't want to lose that blood stalker, so I'm a little bit wanting to get back to Ab as soon as possible. It's not the best one that I have, but I don't really want to lose any tames right now, so. Man, I should have known I was missing stuff because I don't have any of my skins, man. I don't have any of my boss skins. It's like the server rolled back or something. Did the server roll back? I don't even know. Definitely seems like it did or something, though. Weird. All right, so we got our little makeshift doodad place here. Let's go ahead and slap this down. Figure out what we need to make a fabricator really quick that we don't have already. We're going to need some crystal, spark powder, oil paste, and ingots. So I think the only thing that I might actually have to go and farm in that case is going to be... Oh, okay, that's I didn't want those to place like that. Um, is crystal, but that's super easy to get, so I remember they used to stack these elevator stacks and the drops were really high. I think it was around like 50 at a time. Maybe you can still get that, but still, even with the small amount that I had, it's not a small amount of stuff to get from it. Alright, let's put the raw materials away just in case. Put these away. Put our bed down. All right, we need to go and get ourselves some crystal, and then we're gonna have to actually do a primitive forge and a mortar and pestle for the moment, just so that we can get stuff rolling. Once that's done though, we'll be good to go. All right, that's all that we need. We're gonna pick that up. Lap it down there, put one in, the wood in there. Oh, it's cooking quick too, nice. And then we'll cook metal in this one and we'll do a little bit of oil. I will need more oil though. So do I have more? Yeah, I have like a thousand more in there. Okay, so the next goal is going to be get ourselves up and running with some rockets. So let's see what we need for that. We need paste, we're gonna need crystal, gunpowder, polymer, and ingots. So that's not too bad. Um, I'll just go ahead and get crystal on foot. The only thing that I am a little bit worried about is the paste, but as soon as we have a generator crafted, which I might be able to craft now, actually, we can throw up a chem bench. I'm gonna need more foundations though. So let's go hop at a drop, get these foundations down, get a generator put up and do all of that. Once we have our stuff all cooking, We'll try and find something else to do in the meantime. All right, so scuffed as it may be, we're going to go ahead and get this all slapped up here. I'm going to get rid of this, this thing because, like, at this point, it's not really stealthy either way. So why can't I turn this on? Oh, because I need juice for the generator as well. Hello, Caesar. Wake up. All right, so now the only thing that I'm limited on is paste. Wait, why can I make paste? Oh, paste is just stone. Never mind. Whoa, I forgot we made paste easy craft on here. Never mind. I was going to say I'll just demolish one of my uh, industrial forages, but it's easy craft. So, oh, wow. Spark powder is easy craft too. I forgot. Or not spark powder, gunpowder. So it's literally spark powder is stone and flint on our servers. And then it's just spark powder into gunpowder. So I don't even need charcoal, to be honest. I think, yeah, I don't think I need it for anything. So, literally, we're just going to go ahead and pick this thing up. We'll put it back in the obelisk because I don't like having all my stuff out at the same time anyways. 
That way, if somebody does find me right now, somehow, I'll at least have a whole other base in my own. All right, cool. Um, yeah, we need to make a ton of that. Pretty good amount of that. Is that really it? 505 times, yeah, okay, that makes sense. Um, boom, boom. Got the metal. Let's go ahead and get our BPs out. Boom, boom, boom. One, two, three. One, two, three. Well, at least I have somewhat a decent set of armor now. Let's do a quick little sweep past that base again. Um, I want to see if the rock drake there has been moved. I don't know if that was part of their tribe or not. Am I stuck? Am I stuck right now? Please! I don't know if the rock drake was uh, from their tribe or not, but if it's still there, we can check the timer on it and see. It is still here. Ooh. I think... I might be wrong, but I think that timers went down. So we need to pick this up a bit. These guys definitely aren't, like, gone from the server. Alright, let's take these tubes over there, see what we can shake loose, boys. Yeah, this should definitely work. Let's see if this is on neutral. Uh, okay. See no reason why this wouldn't work. Bro, what? That seemed like it hit, like, a lot if it did. I need to make a tribe. Oh my god, that would have been so annoying if I didn't have a tribe. I'm definitely destroying stuff. Oh, I'm definitely destroying stuff. Oh! Solo pepper on top, baby! Dude, that's like half their wall gone. Wait, is it is it offline? I think, I think it's offline. I think I dropped the, the gen that was powering it. No, I did not. Okay, but I dropped, like, more than half the turrets. I just need to shoot on the right-hand side now. Oh, easy, 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 easy. I don't understand how these are, like, getting as far up as they are. Oh, there goes even more. Let's go, baby. I'm taking a lot of damage from my armor right now. Actually, might not be worth using <laughs> until I get, like, a little bit more fortitude. <laughs> So that's concerning because there's still a few that are left there. But I don't see any sort of tech Jenny particles in there. I'm assuming that's where their gen is. Yeah, I can see the gen through the top of the box there. I'm going to keep shooting up. I'm going to try and angle it a little bit farther in, though. I'm hitting something there. Okay, nothing more broke there, so I'm not hitting anything anymore. How many more rockets do I have? Ooh, I'm actually, like, out. I'm going to have to go get more. But we're looking at a pretty good chunk of them gone so far. Yeah, okay, we still have a couple of ground turrets to worry about. Two or three, to be exact. But I think I can splash those. I just need to send a bit more rockets up. So we'll go ahead and uh, grab some more. Send a few more downrange, see what we can shake loose. You know what? Let's just grab the, the structures and stuff while we're here as well. See if I can get a little bit closer to the top. 10 C4, and then we'll do the rest into rockets for now. Oh, that's way too many rockets, so we'll craft a bit. Um, so my, my logic here, guys, if you're wondering, is I'm going to try and build, like, sort of a pillar up. Um, and that way I'll be able to get closer and I can try and rock it and like angle it a little bit better to splash the rocket in there. And that, if that doesn't work, I'll just build as close up as I need to, to where I'm like right below the ledge since I've dropped all that up high turrets and it's just the ground turrets. Then I can third person C4 up onto that ledge and we'll be good to go. I will say, um, if you guys are wondering, you are not allowed to build into bases on here. So if I were to build like, um, 
to the way the turrets couldn't shoot me and it wasn't the terrain that was blocking them then that would be problematic and we would not be allowing that but since it's the terrain that's blocking those turrets it's not not my like structures it's actually fine so put this down here which put me on the ground then let's try and shoot a rocket up where i was trying to get it before see how that goes Maybe put one over there. Nothing's breaking. We'll put a few more. Um, I don't think I'm able to get quite the angle that I need. Actually, maybe if I put another foundation out, though. Yeah, we'll try this. Um, I don't think I'm able to get quite the angle that I need. So I may need to actually do the C4 method, which will just take a couple more walls. If I shoot over here. Well, I got another heavy and some hatch frames there. I don't think that's all of them, though. So let's grab this. This. I'm going to take some fall damage here, but it shouldn't kill me. No? Oh well, we'll go get some more, uh, we'll go get some more walls, and we'll just C4 up there. I don't think there's any way that I get shot going up over this, so. Go here. Place that there, and there should be no possible way that I get shot doing this. I don't know why it just threw me there like that. Hello? Hello? Sir? You want to maybe stop? Why? Are they all gone? I think they're all, I think they're all gone. I'm not gonna lie. I think that was it. So there is still a heavy over there. So we need to be farther left. At this point here, um, it should be good to get up. We'll see. How did that just take? Oh, it was my gauntlets. I thought it took my legs off in one shot. I was about to be like, no shot, dude. Yeah, these are. Oh, they're so loaded, dude. Oh, so much ARB, bro. Now with that, I think I'm just gonna rocket it. Hmm, let's see for it. I need to get rid of it for sure. Can I see for it from here? Out of placement range. Try that. That could work. Oh my god, it targeted my feet! Like, in what universe, bro? This is where it gets dicey, boys. theory i could probably get my body but in practice who knows <sighs> thank god dude that would have been so frustrating if i couldn't get back to my body there all right so there's two turrets over there we need to worry about and then there's this turret right here now these are all going to be capped i'm trying to think of the best possible strategy that we have to get this shit gone unfortunately now we have all this unnecessary um green light around makes it really hard to see anything 
That turret's gonna be so hard to blow, dude. Let's see if I can just sneak my way around on the left and do anything here. Okay, that's not great. I need to... <sighs> I need to try and get somewhere that I can blow those. I don't know, man. This is, this is gonna be scuffed. This is gonna be scuffed! Adrenaline's pumping. I don't see any more turrets besides the one on the ground in the front. And then... Okay, so that one there. And then, you know, okay, so let's put fresh boots on. What else do we have? We have an extra helmet we can put on. Now we're pretty much good the rest of the way. So I'm going to try and just get up and over with my climbing pick here. No, 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 no. Get me off this wall. Get me off this wall. Holy crap. Why? Get up and then I need to get flat on the ground. Maybe I can jump it? I can probably jump it. Yeah. Yeah, we're just gonna throw a lot of C4 on the ground right here. Oh, I'm taking so much damage right now. What kind of flak do I have that I can swap to? chest piece i don't have gloves so that's problematic i think i'm out of boots as well oh my god this is gonna suck dude please okay so that definitely dropped the gen I don't know if that means everything's unpowered though. That's the problem. Oh, it is. We're in. Let's fucking go, boys. That was so dicey. Oh, but it was so worth it. Okay. All right. All right. All right. We need to find something to meet run all their teams. Oh, I can craft more rockets actually. I forgot. I'm gonna be chugging them for a while with this. No crystal though. Pin coated, pin coated. Everything's pin coated, bruh. More poly, there we go. Okay, we're good to go. It's boys. Hopefully they got a Reaper in here. Oh my god, that's taking so much to blow, actually. Um, can I make C4 instead? <laughs> Electronic? Yeah, no, it's going to take way more stuff. You know, ah, there's got to be... Somebody in this, in this base is going to have a kit on them. And that kit's going to have something that I can use. Uh, he's not on, right? Oh, we were taming Karkanos from the looks of it. I'm gonna have some Karks in there for me. So if you guys didn't know, um, <laughs> breaking cryo fridges that are on the ground, kind of a huge pain. Uh, that's why you'll see people use them sometimes on like crouch points and like choke points in caves. Because even in 6X, they take a lot to destroy. I've seen people with um with like the no collision. I've seen people put them in Island Ice's crouch and it's really annoying. So Ooh, here we go. We got ourselves a rock drake, we got some fairies, a Maywing. Ah, uh, you know what? We'll just go ahead and put this thing on aggressive because I don't wanna sit on it. <laughs> and uh yeah, we'll just start pummeling these vaults with rockets, I guess. Would be the move. So I can try and see what's in them. I don't know why I won't equip my rocket launcher, but. Oh, poor aberrant otter. 180 rockets. I don't think I need quite that much. The fact that they didn't have anything in their incubators makes me think these guys might have quit. 
Either that or they're just really good about not leaving eggs. I don't know. Kind of weird. Yeah, I didn't know if that was maybe that the incubators just weren't displaying the eggs they had in them, but no, they truly are empty. Ooh, a bit more ingots in there. I'm gonna put the ingots in this guy, because my inventory is pretty full. Get back to hammering these vaults. Alright, first vault is finally popped. Let's see if it was worth the effort and time. These guys seem to have pretty bad organization, so we'll just go through and cherry pick what we want out of here. It doesn't look like there's going to be a crazy amount of stuff in here, though, based off what I'm seeing so far. Fabricator is going to help. Um, they do have quite a bit of flak, but it looks like none of it's crafted. It looks like it's all from drops, so we're not going to want any of that at all, actually. Oh, OK, there we go. The structures we definitely want. I'll take the capped Megalo saddle. Um, I don't know if I'll use a Megalo, but it'd be nice to have it in case I need it. We'll take the hatchets, actually, because no reason to not have them. Yeah, I don't think I need any of these BPs that they have, which is unfortunate. It would be nice to actually get some BPs from these guys, but I don't know if I will or not. Oh, a Tuso saddle. I'll take that. Uh, Titanosaur saddles I might actually use, so I'll take those. Smithy, again, stone structures even. I'll take another rocket launcher. Uh, more structures, some oil. And the rest of this stuff, honestly, I don't even need, so we're not going to touch. Second vault, let's take a look. It's only stone. I would hate myself. Next vault. Ooh, there we go, baby. That's what I'm looking for. Crafted heavies? We will take that all day. Maybe there'll be a mech in here. Wouldn't that have been something, huh? Pretty good level Kark, though. Some Spinos, Ravagers, PTs. Oh, God, these are dog PTs. What is this, bro? Uh, this breed PT is actually pretty good, though. Um, unless it's been pumped full HP? I don't know. Rock Drake's kind of crap. What about the other Rock Drake? Was it crap? Yeah, unfortunate. Empty cryos. Okay. Well, like I said, they can't all be winners. Oh, there is still a body up there, too. Holy. Or at least access this inventory. Access is it? Oh, okay. I I don't even. I'm I have way too much stuff now at this point. There was a transmitter in here. I think somebody blew it up. Or picked it up. Or just turned it off. Okay, they just turned it off. But can I place a foundation in here? Can. If I can place a foundation, that means I can place a vault, baby! On that, actually. Put the cryos away. Put the hatchets away. I'll put, like, everything away, honestly. And then we'll just pull out what we need. If I come back and somebody's popped these vaults, I will actually be a little bit salty. I'll have to make sure and cherry pick through the vaults and grab everything of value before uh, I upload. And so when I get on next, I'm going to go ahead and build that rat hole. I mean, I guess it's a rat hole. I don't know. You guys let me know in the comments what you think. Is it a rat hole? Yes or no? But yeah, that's that's a big come up getting into there. And we have a lot of tames that we need. I think I have to look through them, but I think I got some farming tames out of that. But I definitely got like some DPS dinos and stuff that I can use over here on Ab. At the end of the day, that's still come up. I got all the heavies, which is a big deal. I got like a whole crafting area out of that raid and a ton of like resources and stuff. So let me check the cryos here. I got some ravagers, spinos, a vel, a couple of rock drakes, some trikes, which actually seem pretty decent which is sick because i love trike soaking it's probably the best way to soak as a solo player i did get an anki i thought i saw an anki in there got a kark 
another May wing, which I lost my May wing because it was in my inventory and the inventory got deleted. So that's good that I found that. Oh, that was a really, really good choice. Like this isn't a crazy amount of stuff, but like anything is big right now, you know? All right, nothing on the Ravager. So I think I have enough cryopods now to cry everything up. I do, so get the cryos. So now I got a fairy. I can get quite a bit of resources with that. I got an Anki. I can take that over to CI and get a bunch of metal. And I know what you're thinking, Caesar. You're on Ab. Why would you not just farm on Ab? Well, because that's a pain to do when you don't have two people. And this is Sola. So I could go and do some missions and maybe try and tame a Strider. Uh, I don't know if I want to do that, though. But not a bad haul. Like, pretty decent chunk of cryo tames. Decent chunk of, like, raw mats and, like, structures. Not bad. Not bad at all, guys. All right. We'll drop off the cannonballs, and then we're finally good to go. This took forever, actually. I'm looking at the recording now. I'm 51 minutes, and I know it was, like, 25 minutes beforehand. So it was actually a pretty long raid, all things considered. But at the end of the day, it was worth it. I mean, a pretty sick start. Got a bunch of cannonballs. I already have a Karkonos, so I don't need to worry about getting one of those. I don't even know what I'd use a Karkonos for as a solo player. I guess base defense, but not in the spot that I'm in. Those cannonballs are more than likely coming to a base near you. But unfortunately, guys, that's going to be it for this little solo series. Only was able to eke out two episodes until I unfortunately had to go back to doing admin stuff for the rest of the season. Uh, anytime that I am playing on the servers, I take my admin rank away. And with me being gone, it ended up being a little bit overwhelmed because there was other people on the admin team that had stuff going on in their lives as well. So I ended up stepping back into my admin role and letting all of my stuff in my obelisk despawn. Um, somebody probably did find those vaults eventually and i didn't actually even pin code them so hopefully they enjoyed the loot hopefully you guys enjoyed this small little taste of a solo series um i don't really like playing solo all that much i do prefer to play with a group but i know that you guys do like seeing how solo players operate and stuff so i'll probably do it again sometime in the near future anyways like i said at the beginning of the video if you guys don't already know caesar's arc is going to be wiping february 12th that's tomorrow as of the upload of this video if you're watching it after the upload it's already wiped come join us check what the servers are like and hopefully you guys enjoy them anyways that's going to do it for this video hopefully you guys enjoyed and i'll see you guys in the next one peace